A highly contagious infection is making its way into Tippecanoe County just as schools are set to go back into session. News 18's Vinnie Martirana was live outside the Tippecanoe County Health Department with a look at what kids should be on alert for. Vinnie? Yeah, Jeff, the Tippecanoe County Health Officer, Dr. Greg Loomis, told me that they found the first case of whooping cough here in Tippecanoe County. He told me to reiterate the fact that everyone should be getting vaccinated. Tippecanoe County Health Officer, Dr. Greg Loomis, told News 18 whooping cough has been found in a child here in Tippecanoe County. And we have a, a young person who has it that exposed probably about 30 other people and possibly some adults. So we do have some people on prophylactic treatment right now. Whooping cough is a highly contagious respiratory infection. Normally the cough is an irritation of the upper airway in the lung and it causes an exasperating cough where you can even break ribs. And then when you're exhausted of air, you go <gasps> and you kind of get a whoop sound. That's the whoop of whooping cough, and it's just ex people pass out from it. Loomis says whooping cough is extremely concerning for young children. Highly, highly, highly contagious. It, it can be lethal to children under the age of two. With school back in session in the next two weeks, Loomis has concerns about it spreading. The younger the child, the more problems come with it. When we see kids this age, we're worried about it because it could spread into older siblings, and thank heavens we're not in school right now. Older siblings can catch whooping cough and spread it to other students in school. Loomis says the schools are prepared to handle this situation. They have a full protocol. It's a, it's a reportable case to the state. We have everybody in place that if we had to do a mass prophylactic kind of treatment, we are ready to go with that. Loomis says these diseases are not going away. He says it's important to get your vaccinations. I want to let the community know that you must get vaccinated. It's crucial because these diseases are still around. I'm waiting, I, I will go on record as saying it's a matter of time until we see a measles case. It's gonna happen. Dr. Loomis told me it's been an uphill battle trying to get people to get vaccinated for diseases since the COVID-19 pandemic. He reiterates that just because others around you are vaccinated, that doesn't mean you still can't give it to them if you carry the disease. Reporting live in Lafayette, Vinnie Mortorano, News 18.